What's good YouTube? It's your boy here, First Time Rado, coming at you with another video. It's summertime, it's hot, so we figure it's time to go topless, let them hang, freedom time. So here's a quick tutorial on how to get your Jeep naked. We're going to pull the top off, pull the back off, and the doors off. First we're going to remove the freedom tops. You want to come in here and unscrew these two guys here. This guy here. And then you have these little flips. Two, three, and four. And then you just want to unhook these right here. And you are good to go. You can actually just use a little pressure and push these off. Now before lifting the top off, you do need to remove these cables back here uh, for the windshield wiper and the brake lights. Um, this one's pretty easy. There's a kind of an oval piece right here. Just squeeze uh, the oblong parts or the longer parts and then just pull that out. And then for this guy, just push this lever to the right. And then there's a little button right here. And pull that out. Next for the hardcover, you want to get your Jeep tools right here. Uh, grab your little ratchet and this middle guy and from there you can get these six screws one two three on the left uh, then you come to the right same side one two three um, I pretty much already have those pulled out and once you have those uh, yanked out actually in your back area if you lift this up you have places for to hold those screws here now for lifting the Hard top, this is my simple hoist system. Um, you can see I just drilled some 2x4s into the ceiling, um, put some hooks up there, and then with the straps, um, just kind of, kind of measured it so it's at the bottom of the uh, hard top, and then slowly, just one side at a time, I'll just slowly lift this up. And from here, you can just go ahead and crank the top up once you get the hooks uh, lined up underneath. And uh, I've actually got some help, but this is actually something that you can do by yourself, but you just end up walking around the vehicle a few times because you want to take it up as evenly as possible. Um, but it's nice having help here. They can just go ahead and get this cranked up, get it cranked up as high as they can, and you've got the hard top stowed away for the summer. And I like to hoist mine up high enough just to make sure I have enough clearance to get underneath it. Um, and then with this extra or excess strap, um, I just like to roll it up and just throw it on top so it's put away. Before removing the doors, you do need to remove these wire harnesses. Um, I have these like door braces here, so um, you do have to remove anything like that. But the, really the tricky part is gonna be this wire harness here. Um, it should look just like that. The way to undo that is just pull this red lever down and then push this red lever and this uh, black thing together. And then that whole piece will just come apart just like that. So make sure you do that before you remove the doors. Now to unscrew the doors, you grab your trusty tools again. Um, now you're gonna have the large uh, setting up here on the top. And the bolts that you wanna remove are gonna be underneath the door hinge, uh, right here and right here. Um, so it's gonna be a little tight uh, just because of the placement of my uh, jack, um, but you're gonna make sure that you get those done um, on both sides. Once the screws are uh, unscrewed and it's stored away in the back, um, you can actually just open the doors and just lift these guys up um, and just make sure you have a good place to store them. Um, you can uh, move the mirror, flatten the mirrors out as well just so it takes up a little less space. All right, I've got the two doors pulled off. Uh, this is what these uh, little knobs look like when you pull them off. So you wanna open up the door uh, with your windows down. Um, once you have the screw that comes off at here out of the bottom, um, then you're just going to lift this up. These get stuck quite a bit, so sometimes you can try to squeeze a little um, WD-40 or like silicon lube in there um, and then kind of wiggle the door back and forth so it can get in there. Um, but essentially you just need to have enough pressure from the bottom, so you're going to grab it from down here and try to lift up. Um, I thought the best thing really if it's stuck is just to have someone else um, help you and give you a little uh, power from the bottom as well um, definitely you can bang it around with uh, you know a hammer um, a, a rubber mallet or if you get a, like a block of wood then you can kind of bang it around a little bit just see if you can loosen it up um, and then put that silicone in there but uh, it does stick quite a bit so just and there she is the Jeep parked in the garage completely naked uh, we got her topless earlier then we popped those doors off 
I'm going to hang the, uh, the hoist right up there, so that's how um, that's going to hang for the rest of the summer. And now it's time to go have some fun in the Jeep. Thanks for watching the video. Uh, please consider hitting that like and subscribe button. And until our next video comes out, keep turning those wrenches and stay safe. Thanks, guys.